Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. This is your Raghavindraj. If you are a EPFO member already, so you have to do two things importantly. One is you have to ensure that whether is your UAN is activated or not. And also second thing is whether you, you have activated face authentication in the Umang app. So these two things are very important going ahead for you to get the benefits and the claim process all those things are going to be uh, you know working out for you in this uh, process so therefore UAN activation and face authentication using Umang app are more or less mandatory for all employees who are the members of uh, you know uh, EPFO already so in the previous videos we have already talked about how to uh, create new uh, UANs using Umang all those things now let me take you through if you are an existing EPFO member, uh, you have to ensure that whether your UAN is activated or not and also you have to ensure that your face is authenticated in Umang app. So these are two important uh, uh, tasks as an employee you have and if you are watching as an employer or uh, management staff who is looking after for EPFO related matters, so you have to educate and advise your employees to ensure these two things in the Umang app. Now, before getting into that, which uh, I have already told you in the previous videos, you need two apps. One is uh, Umang app, the, uh, the second one is Aadhaar Face RD app. For these two things, you have to check it. So to check these two things and complete these two things, you need two uh, apps. So you can download these two things uh, if you are an Android phone. So you can go to Google Play Store and uh, download these two options or if you have uh, you know iPhone you can go to App Store and download it and keep it ready so now I'm going to get you uh, take you through this uh, process how to do it let's get into this uh, video friends now I'm getting into the Umang app so the moment I uh, log in to the Umang app so giving my mobile number and also uh, the M pin so you have to do these two things uh, before getting into it now I'm going to the EPFO section where there is something called face authentication of already uh, you know existing UANs activated UANs now you have to register or you have to getting get into the Umang app first by giving your mobile number and M pin as I have already told you now the second thing is you have to go to EPFO section and then click this uh, uh, you know face authentication the moment face authentication is clicked so this window will come so you have to show your uh, photo properly the uh, the face properly. Uh, fully lighted and also you have to blink your eyes so that it can capture the moment green comes so it will automatically capture your face and the face authentication will process it now after this what happens is you have to give your UAN number Aadhaar number and mobile number so if you give all these things then submit it then so this will show you whether your face is activated or not so it's showing other face authentication is successful already now you have to check it whether your uan is activated or not so uh, that is also again you have to give your uan number and also other number and mobile number then it will show you whether your uan entered is already activated or not so friends we have seen this process very uh, you know uh, fast and i'm sure this has got uh, this video has got benefited you and in case if this information is useful to you please do subscribe the channel and share it in your network and don't forget to like this video friends uh, in the uh, going ahead in the future i'm going to come up with more and more new videos and until then i'm going to sign off see you soon friends